Hello everybody. Today what I wanted to do with you guys is actually show you how to create a team and then have members add to that project folder that we're going to create inside of that team. And this is great because what that does, it allows us to then share all of our parts out so everyone can contribute to that. So for you guys, you're going to be making a toy, be it a car or a crane or something like that. So hopefully you guys will decide on who's going to draw which parts. So what I would like to do, we're going to go up into the data panel, comes to the data panel. I've actually created already in here a project. And I think I've shown you previously how to create a project by creating a new project. I've called my one toys. Okay, so we've got that already set up. Then what I want to do up in the top left-hand corner, uh, it has teams you are a member of. So I'm already a member of several teams, but everyone will have their own team. So one person in your group will be the team manager. So what we will do, we'll go across and we're going to open the administrator console on the web. And then we're going to add all your team members to that. Okay, so I'm going to open this up. And we come to this page. And as you can sort of see, I've already got my project folder here. And you only really want to share that folder with others, other members. Don't share your whole thing because they can go in and edit all your drawings. So we'll click on that. And then... I've got one project member in there at the moment, which is myself, but you just invite and add all the users into that. Okay, and then you'll be able to uh, give them different privileges. So just pre on this other drawing I've done with another group, I've got, uh, so Sam's in here and he's an editor. And that you'll have like three or four or five students in that. And that's what we need to get to today.